Monaco have clawed their way back into European contention by taking 13 points from a possible 15. Their form across all competitions, particularly impressive of late, having won eight of their last nine games. They also reached the semi-finals of the League Cup by beating Gangor and Midweek. Nantes arrived unbeaten in their last three league outings, but licking their wounds after being dumped out to the League Cup by Lille on Wednesday. Serge Gakbe has struggled for goals this season, the Nantes striker with just one to his name thus far. As he drew a save from Daniel Subasic early on. Anthony Martial scored very late on to wrap up a 2 0 win over Gangor on Wednesday. The Monaco youngster giving the Nantes defence a glimpse of his skills for teeing up Yannick Ferreira Carrasco. Although the Belgian this time couldn't get a shot away. Down our first 45 minutes in the Principality. Monaco again improving a difficult proposition to break down, but also with little to show for going forward. Neither side showed too many signs of breaking the deadlock early in the second half either. But on 63 minutes, Levin Kazawa's rather hopeful through ball ended up with the feet of Ferreira Carrasco. He rounded Remy Rio, but he couldn't find a way past Luca Do was back on the line, covering for his keeper. Rue then made a smart one-handed save on at 73 minutes to turn away a crisp low drive from Fabinho. Monaco, though, did find the way through a minute later. Kazawa's dragged effort taking a series of deflections Inside the box, a fort falling invitingly for Bernardo Silva, the Portuguese midfielder. Slipping the ball behind Rio for his second of the season. The unknown Benfica man scored the game's only goal against Marseille last month. He appeared to have conjured up another match winner on Saturday. An overwhelming factor in Monaco's resurgence has been a watertight defence. They came into the weekend with five straight clean sheets. Subasic doing his bit to keep the host in front with an excellent stop to deny Yassin Bamu. Long continued to press for an equaliser. Johan Odell getting himself into a great position only for Andrea Ranji to come across and get a crucial touch on the ball. Deep into stoppage time. Well, that led to a corner and incredibly. Ordell would get another chance to salvage a point for his side. With Rue up from the back and a final roll of the dice. The corner would fall to it. Jordan Veritu. His effort off target, but straight to Ordell, who could only divert the ball onto the bar from six yards out. Not onto that close to a dramatic late equaliser, but Monaco clung on for a 1-0 win. That's now five wins in six for Leonardo Jardim's men.